So as I said, we've got a very exciting day today. We're going to run through what everyone's doing, um, making sure everyone's progressing or if anyone's stuck, kind of give them guidance. And then Vinny and Mia are going to demo their interview. So I'll do two separate recordings, this one for the stand-up and then a later one for the demo. Um, and as I said to you guys, the demo will be something that everyone will be doing. Don't be harsh. Um, be nice. And, you know, it's also a chance for you to look at somebody else's interview and see if there's anything in there that you maybe want. Um, so it's a give and a take thing. Um, so with that being said, let's quickly run through um, what everybody's been up to and then we can go on to the demo. Okay. So I'm just going to really quickly say that. And our, one of our new members, Chai, uh, I think it's Kai or Chai. I have Kai. Not, right. Um, I think I misinformed her about, I think I confused her about some stuff. So she should be on at one, I think, at the latest. Okay. Well, it'll be nice to meet her. Um, okay. So Matt, not Mike, <laughs> Matt Millard. Are you speaking I, for you guys? Um, yeah. So... <clears throat> We're, um, we're, we're working on our testing templates. We thought we were ready to um, have Michelle take a look at it. And then she had us kind of run through the test and do it ourselves first. And when I was doing that, I kind of noticed some inconsistencies with what our test was asking and the interview that I think could lead to some confusion if, you know, someone hadn't uh, been in the process of designing it. Okay. So we're going to try to uh, fix the testing template up today. Hopefully we'll be ready to go on Monday to have that looked at. I was thinking perhaps, you know, I was looking at, I was going over with um, J Jason and Eleni and then also had a look at Sinead and Fanola's tests. Um, it might be beneficial if we have another kind of like group testing call sometime next week, um, just to kind of go over everything and make sure that we're all on the same page and, you know, things that we've learned in the last, you know, individually, um, just get together and have an hour about that sometime next week. Um, so I'll put that in the assembly line channel, just make a note to do that. And then if we could just kind of get a, um, a date and a time set up, I'll put a doodle in. Um, because there's a couple of things that have come up in the last two or three weeks that maybe I've dealt with individually and not shared properly with everybody. Um, so just to emphasize that, that kind of communication and make sure that everyone's on the same page with the testing. Um, okay. So Matt, Matt, um, Matt, Aubrey, and Blake, you guys are going to be just working on your testing today, and then Monday we'll have a look at it. Some awesome work there, though. A lot of work there. Really good work. Sorry. I must say, every test that I've seen, you know, I was, today I was looking at um, the com temp Complaint for Contempt, and then also Sinead and Fernando's one. You guys have really picked it up so quickly, and it's just looking really, really good. The amount of effort and time that you've put in to not only the interviews, but also the testing of the interviews. Um, really good okay so sam and that's just sam today eric's around too <laughs> um I'm so I'm oh and eric oh yeah okay the dream team hi guys yeah. hi. hello uh, mark's down in dc for the day just so you know of course uh, <laughs> <laughs> globe trotter <laughs> oh um, my god <laughs> So we don't have too much to report today. Um, we're just kind of steadily working on something that we learned yesterday that Michelle helped us out with, uh, which will be a huge step for us. We're able to loop certain parts of our interview so that we can ask more of the same question and kind of just like fill up a list. Um, so I'm tinkering around with that, seeing if I can implement it on my own, um, having some success, some failure, but if I keep on working at it, I should be fine. Um, I'm assuming Eric's probably in the same position. Um, and probably by Monday, Eric, Mark, and I are going to be able to reconvene and kind of all work together on this. So uh, okay. we should iron out a lot of the kinks in our, in our interview by then. Uh, Eric, one, one issue that I foresee that we'll have to do is make uh, addenda with the ginger, ginger application. Michelle was explaining that. Okay, uh, and that was- How to do it. I don't know, but it seems that perhaps other people will have that issue as well. I don't so know about other one thing that that was mentioned that was that caroline actually raised for um discussion um on our monday meeting was the issue of addenda so maybe what we'll do is we'll discuss it on that monday meeting at one o'clock and then we will get back to you about that okay. we might we might make that part of a pipeline so that so that they're so it's it's less on you know everybody learning ginger I, never mind carry on okay um, and it's working for you guys in terms of time difference and everything like that. Yeah, this time's, this time's perfect. 
it's really light where you are oh my gosh okay um okay so that's good good glad to hear that um Vinny and Mia I mean is the update that you've just been prepping for the demo yeah and that all of our testing has passed and is done hopefully we won't find anything wrong <laughs> that live demo <laughs> I'm very excited Thanks, to see <laughs> Did I just jinx it? I'm really sorry. Um, Mike Cronin uh, of Mike and Tyler. How was your meeting yesterday with uh, Matt? You said you were going to update us today. Yeah, it was uh, really productive. Um, he kind of just answered a lot of questions that I had about like what we were trying to accomplish in the interview. And um, he sent me the document templates, which was good. That's, that's really helpful. Um, I'm, so I'm working through the interview right now. I got to tweak it. I think I got to, uh, I think I'm going to use our basic questions YAML file to, to pull some stuff from like the users and opposing parties kind of questions. Um, for the most part, it's good. One thing he did explain though is, is that there's two forms of that um, interview and there's one that's just like a general vacate um, for consumer default, but then there's one that they have that's COVID related um, and that's different. So I don't know if we want to try to do that one as well. At yeah, some maybe point, emphasize, like, emphasize that one yeah. because that's obviously emergency related. It's kind of like the non-essential yeah. eviction um, one yeah. that Quinton worked on. Guy, uh, Quinton and David, should we incorporate that? How long do we think COVID's going to last? <laughs> Not qualified to answer that question. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I think it, it okay. might be worth looking at because even if COVID is over, you're still going to have debt that's related to COVID. So depending on what that, um, what that form, how that form works, just it's a question because for Matt, the emergency's really? over Sorry. doesn't gonna, yeah. isn't gonna isn't gonna make it. You know, you're still gonna have that debt, and the debt may be COVID related. Mm -hmm. So it yeah, depends when, on what the form says. When uh, we were talking to Matt about it yesterday, it's it's like really minute changes to the document too. So it's not gonna be like hard to do the COVID yeah. one as well. It's just like mm -hmm. little details. So yeah. it wouldn't be that much more trouble. I'd say go for it. Then. Yeah, yeah, then. Okay. Are, you okay, are you okay to do? That's a go. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Okay, great. I'm excited to see that. So you've got two things to demo. I still need to reach out to Tyler about the testing. Um, yeah. I forgot to do that yesterday, sorry. Okay, I've put a mm -hmm. note in my thing to do that today. And then we'll see. Yeah. I, said, I said because you guys have already done the first demo, I think that maybe um, you guys can be the first up next week. As I said, sure. everyone, everybody who's in the testing stage of the workflow is really ready to demo. Um, so I'll put up a schedule when I put up the testing call schedule and um, we'll see, you know, just get some slots. Um, and we'll also see how long it goes with Mia and Vinny today. Um, the idea is obviously to keep, be conscious of everyone's time and to try and keep this brief, but also informative. Um, okay, uh, Sinead and Fedola, how's it going with you guys? Um, yeah, it's going good. Um, a testing meeting next week sounds really good, actually. Um, uh, I've been writing our test cases. We kind of incorporated those changes that you um, told us about. Okay. And actually, as we've been writing the test cases, we've come across, you know, inconsistencies and things that might cause confusion. So as we're writing them, we're just kind of changing as we go along. Changing but the test cases or changing the interview? The test cases. Okay. So just kind of, no, not the interview. <laughs> um, so just kind of making sure everything is consistent. Okay, well, that's good to hear. Yeah. Um, so yeah, so I think what, what I'll try and do it in the first half of next week, and it will just basically cover things that I've spotted over the last few weeks when going through interviews and um, maybe get uh, Michelle as well to, to, to chip in there because I think we have some ideas about the testing. Yeah, um, perfect. And is there anything updated on the website? Or are we just going to speak about that on Monday at the management meeting? Um, well, we are kind of still waiting for a few people to submit their bios through the form. Um, people that are on this call or? Um, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, cool. Um, yeah. Just on the call, Jody has to submit hers, but then there's just a few others. Um, I think there's like Mariah, Deshaun, a few people like that. Maybe just if you wouldn't mind just following up with them, that would be great. Totally. Can, can we update with what we have? I mean, we have been. I think they ha you guys have been making. Yeah, we're rolling updates. Yeah, That's I think it awesome. might just be Jody on the call, and then we can reach out Jody, to the Jody. Other Jody. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to land her in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. It motivates. You're, you're fired from your volunteer <laughs> position. 
Okay. Um, and, then, and then, as I said, we, so last week, or this week already, actually, time is just blending into one thing. Um, uh, Sinead and Fanola kind of found some different layouts for our team um, thing, so we're going to speak about that on Monday. Um, okay. Uh, Eleni and Jason and James. Hi. Hi. Um, so we met with you this morning, as you know. I do know. And that. ever since then, we were just like making improvements and continuing. And how do you feel about um, uh, what the workflow that we, we suggested? And, and have you been able to, has it been a monumental job to make those changes? Or is it doable? Um, as of right now, I think it's pretty doable. Okay. So do you have an idea, kind of like an estimated idea when you would be finished making those changes? Um, that's something that I should discuss with James and Jason first. Defer sure. to your learned colleagues. I feel you. Um, okay, so why don't you guys speak about that and then hopefully we can um, uh, bring it up in the testing meeting Monday or Tuesday next week and, and if there's any more questions that you guys have, we can raise them there. Sure. But as again, as I said earlier, really, really impressed with the way that you guys have handled these, these tests and this testing process in general. Um, I know it's been a little bit of, a, it's a lot of information to take in and to try and comprehend, but everybody's done a really fantastic job. Um, so I'm going to open up the floor. Is there anything that anybody else needs to add to a 9A testing wise, to a 9A release, um, uh, non-essential evictions, just thinking of things out loud? Um, the logistics for signing the moratorium through email and um, the multi-user thing, that is pretty close to done. It's a matter of like formatting the docx um deciding on the rest of the flow i need to check on whether we need the qr code um type of flow for for the multi-user signers as well in case they're on their computer and want to sign on their phone or is yeah. that a necessary part or like where does that fit in there um and then um working on mariah with the flow and but the uh, the basic the, the, like it's, it's solid other than moving those things around. The, and does, the functionality I mean, is solid. Do yeah. you, uh, you um, anticipate uh, a large amount of work going into those last kind of finishing bits or would you say? Probably, like but it depends how, how many we want to do. I want to have an understanding of our MVP and I can say, I can make a better estimate once I understand what the MVP is. Okay. Okay, so can we leave you just to discuss this with Mariah? Uh, sure. I think it also, because it's a form that's going to go on MABC, um, I'd like input from like Quentin or Caroline or like whoever, whoever does the final kind of. David? This is the flow we want. Yeah, or David. Okay. I can talk David to him later like though. The are. Okay, so you'll put a message out and link offline. Okay, guys, very exciting. That ends today's meeting. I'm going to stop recording and then I'm going to start wait, recording. Wait, 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 wait. Oh! Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, what is it? Um, is there anyone that has an Android phone that has maybe like 20 minutes to do a quick test for the 209A? We all iPhone, guys, no. <laughs> yes. How about, how about, how about the people about that? How about the people um, that aren't visible? You know what? Oh, my I have an Android, but I won't be able to do it this evening straight away because I have to go drop someone somewhere. But when would it have to be done? Oh, Sinead, do you have an Android? Yeah. It can be done later tonight, right, Caroline? No, it could be done next week. It's just this little, it's like the one thing we haven't tested. And, you know, Any we tests know we haven't tested it. Any tests were on an Android, they weren't on an iPhone. an Android, you know, it would be nice to know. Um, Sinead's you know, just saying get, that she did all of her tests on an Android, Caroline. Who did? Yes. Yeah. I did mine on a Samsung. Bless you, Sam. That is Android, right? Yeah. yeah. And you, oh, well, then that's fine. Then we're good. Yeah. So it's it, was, it, wasn't this, it wasn't this one piece. It was just in general. Okay. I just wanted to know that we weren't. Okay. So that's oh, perfect. Me. So um, David nervous. said we were live on Wednesday, and I and Quentin's going, it's a soft launch. It's a, anyway. We now have over 20 links on Mass Legal Help to it. So uh, that's great. Um, this is amazing. <laughs> that's really awesome. Good. Sinead, thank you. That's perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's great. great okay. Job. I'm going to stop recording now.
Okay. And then I'm going to start again.